Hi, I'm Ben Gaines with Adobe Analytics Product Management. In this video, I want to show you how you can use Analysis Workspace to limit users within a project to a certain segment. Um, this will allow you to ensure that whenever they're using this project, they're only operating within the segment that you've defined for them and that they can't see any data outside of that segment. Um, this little tip or trick combines uh, calculated metrics with segmentation uh, with analysis workspace. So I'm going to build just a simple uh, table here. I'm going to um, have a metric uh, that I'm going to actually get rid of. Um, and uh, so let's say in this project I want to, I have my, my product finding methods and I want uh, users of this project to be limited to the uh, weekend adventurers segment that you've got here. And I can actually add that, add that up here and you know, take revenue over. And, and now I'm looking at revenue for my weekend adventurers only. Uh, but, of course, uh, if I share this project as is, someone can come in and just remove the weekend adventurers segment, and now they're back to looking at all of my data. So uh, I don't want them to be able to do that. I don't want them to be able to get rid of that segment. I want them to be, to be stuck with it. Um, to do this, I'm going to build a series of calculated metrics. I'm going to build one for every metric uh, that I want to share in this project. Um, so you can see I've actually pre-built a couple of them, Weekend Adventurers Orders and Weekend Adventurers Revenue. I'm going to build one more. So I'm going to launch the Calculated Metric Builder. I'm going to find my Weekend Adventurers segment, drag it over to the canvas. And this time I'll do, uh, let's do a uh, conversion rate. So I can find conversion rate and drag it over and put it on my uh, canvas here and you can see that it actually uh, explodes it out because it, it in and of itself is a calculated metric. So I'm going to call this Weekend Adventures whoops, Conversion Rate. And I'm going to um, make it a uh, percentage and uh, give it a couple of decimal places. Very good. So we've got our metric. I'm going to save that. And now uh, I can, I can uh, work with that here uh, as well. So I'm actually going to um, get rid of revenue. And I'm going to add my weekend adventurers revenue on here. So now you can see um, this. Uh, and if actually, to, just to hammer this home, I'll, I'll add weekend adventurers uh, as a segment as well, and you'll see the data won't change when I do that. Same data, because the same segment exists within the metric and exists at the project level, so I can clear that out. So now uh, I, can't, uh, I can't escape from Weekend Adventures as I'm looking at revenue here. Now um, I can go into Curate. I'm going to add, add a simple visualization just to round this out. And if I go into Curate, uh, you'll notice that I've got my Weekend Adventures revenue included in here, and I'm going gonna, I'm gonna, to uh, go look at my other Weekend Adventures metrics. I'm going to take orders and conversion rate, and I'm going to add them here. Uh, so those are the three metrics now that are available. And then I could add additional segments if I wanted to look at first-time Weekend Adventures, for example. I can give them the opportunity to do that, and I can even add the Weekend Adventures segment. There's no reason not to. And when I hit Done, you'll notice that now the only metrics I have to work with in this project are my Weekend Adventurers metrics, which means, since you need a metric in order to get data back, uh, it means that there's no way for me to get data back in this project without using the Weekend Adventurers segment because that segment is included in each of these metrics. So now when I share this out with my team uh, and they log in to, uh, to use this project, uh, I'll call this Weekend Adventurers. Um, they will be able to use this project, but they will only uh, be able to um, they'll only be able to use metrics that contain this Weekend Adventurers segment. So within this project, they won't be able to escape from that metric, um, which is a, a neat little a neat little way for me to make sure they're focused on the things that that are relevant for them. Now, of course, this isn't this isn't quite the same as permissioning data. So they could still go out to uh, reports and analytics or a different project in analysis workspace and use other segments there. But within this project, it makes sure that they are laser focused 
on that weekend adventurer segment, which is important to them.